I want you to know that the children, the poor children in Asia and around the world are not suffering because of you. And I want you to know that communist bullshitters constantly put out disinformation. Constantly. Communist bullshitters constantly put out disinformation. Why they have such motivation, I don't know. And greetings to my 200 subscribers. You may wonder why I make videos about Sequinom, for example. Well, it's because a few years ago, my mother died. and The first thing I did is opened her chest of drawers and dug through her underwear looking for where she had stashed her money. And uh, I found it. A hundred bucks. Ah! A hundred bucks. I'm rich. And I thought to myself, I could buy crack methamphetamines with this money. But I thought, no, I need to start thinking ahead. I'll be old someday. And uh, I'll, I'll need groceries. I'm going to do the responsible thing. I'm going to take this hundred dollars and invest it in the stock market. Or I should be more clear and say I'm going to invest. I'm going to I'm going to speculate. I'm going to gamble with this money. And so I started making videos about Sequinom, for example. Would it be correct for me to assume that I have 200 subscribers because I make videos about Sequinom? Frankly, I know that you're not interested in Sequinom and likely have never heard of it before. Well, a similar leap of logic, by the way, I didn't steal $100 from my dead mama. I had a job once, and I saved $100 or so. But I had to get your attention some way. Because I know that you're not interested in Sequinom, and you're not interested in uh, children in India who have to tote water on their shoulders. But I just want you to know that the children in India, or Bangladesh, toting that water, are not suffering because of you. That's, what I, that's the purpose of this video. I want you to know that the children, the poor children, in Asia, and around the world, are not suffering because of you. And I want you to know that communist bullshitters constantly put out disinformation. Constantly. Communist bullshitters constantly put out disinformation. Why they have such motivation, I don't know. Why they persist decades after decades after decades putting out bullshit, I don't know. I don't know why they don't find something else to do. They must have some big incentive. There must be something in it for them, just like there's something in it for me by trading stocks. They must have a motivation. I'm not clear what that is. It probably is similar to mine. They're probably after the loot. They're probably after the loot. I don't steal money from dead parents, and um, luckily, I, you know, I haven't been I haven't been under that much pressure. I haven't sunk that low yet, and I hope I never do. And there, because I have not turned to crime yet and I hope I never do, I'm not motivated to lie and to con and to perpetrate hoaxes on the innocent yet, and I hope I never do. But the communists have been put under such pressure. They have sunk to such low levels. They do put out propaganda and lies and disinformation. Global warming, man-made global warming, is one such example. And that being said, now let's see what the stock market's doing.